welcome to Inzion. How are you? Today we discuss about Sudachi emulator. There are new version here 1.09. Let's check out the Sudachi emulator and see which phone is work on from low end to high end device. And I'm honestly telling you the emulator testing video is not mine. So please support his channels. But if you're new here, then please subscribe and never forget to click the bell icon and 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 follow me on Instagram. If you have any question, then DM me hmm. and comment the Sudachi. I pin the comment and I reply it. I hope you understand it. Let's talk about Sudachi update. In this update, fix bug and added new feature added a additional page to the setup flow and button to the setting page allowing user to select the title key file uh, if you title and product key then title key is uh, added some uh, okay some time and fix a issue where the app would crash when installing a dlc or update basically related on the title and product key there's a two update related on a title and product key. There's a must, uh, there's a major issue in this emulator. So that's why so much crashing for this reason. That's why fixing this and, and so much more update for related to title and keys. Phone name is IQ00 yeah, IQ 9 SE 5G. Okay, processor is a Snapdragon uh, 888 and is RAM is 8GB. How much perform emulator? Basically, I describe in this video for only performing, performing. How much perform in this emulator in this phone? Okay, the the game runs at a normal fps of a 30 40 but when there are graphical changes a lot of lagging issue however the virtual control remain stable and the game settings are optimized for the phone despite that the game still lag and get stuck while running some game perform well without lag but other experience uh, stuttering lag and get stuck during a gameplay the good part is that the emulator doesn't crash and working well next phone is a poco f6 pro there are two variant of processor uh, first is a mali gpu okay second is snapdragon okay so, uh, mali gpu uh, there is a 8300 ultra and second one is snapdragon 8 gen 2 both ram are equal and both storage are equal uh, ram is 12 and uh, storage is 512 the mali gpu perform well in this emulator when playing a mario game with the fps ranging between a 30 40 the game sound is so clear with no glitching however when running the heavy games the emulator crashes in a mali gpu uh, i'm not uh, maybe maybe crashes maybe not crashes but uh, but probably crashing now let's talk about a snapdragon performance it's a perform pretty well with the fps ranging between the 30 and 40 the sound is clear with the no buffering but there are some minor graphical glitches and a slight delay in the control response ah next trying to low end device if you have a low end device then please watch it okay next phone is a realme narzo 10 it's mine and its processor a helio g80 process there's a mali gpu and storage is a 128 gb and 4 gb ram that's a low end device <laughs> so low end <laughs> on my device the game is working but there are many graphical glitches even the lowest setting in the emulator i also tried playing pokemon let's go pikachu but uh, couldn't get the emulator to work properly mainly due to and the issue the uh, dock mode in the setting i changed the setting dock mode uh, button on and off but still didn't work uh, if you face this problem please comment the solution uh, the sound is fine with no buffering but the game appear range from 5 
फाइव टू ट्वेंटी एंड इट्स लैक्स अ लॉट इट्स टेकन अ लॉन्ग टाइम टू प्ले सो आई सज द लो एंड डिवाइस वॉन्ट टू वर्क डिडेंट वर्क वेल विद द एमुलेटर थ्रू थ्रू इट्स मे टू मे बी इम्प्रूव इन द फ्यूचर ओके दैट्स टूडे इन द वीडियो If you want to wo- watch more video like this then click the left or right until then bye bye see you in the next video